Ivan Walking Shed. Dead. Jesus. So yeah, moving on with the tour, we're going to have our Walking Dead show, our property right here as well too. It's been a popular line for us for the past few years and continuing on the tradition here, we're going to start off with our 5-inch deluxe three-pack of Rick, Daryl, and Jesus, the Allies three-pack we're going to call it. Uh, it's going to feature them in their garb when they first encounter one another. And then we're going to move on to our new 10-inch line. Uh, we're going to have a Daryl Dixon uh, in his new wardrobe as well from the All Out War uh, story arc in the show that's going on currently. And then we're going to also have a seven-inch figure of Daryl in his savior prisoner garb when he was captured by Negan and the Saviors and forced to, you know, mop up the floor, eat, eat some rotten sandwiches, things like that. And then we're also going to have King Ezekiel in a seven-inch line coming out this year as well. you got to make a musical one that plays a song. Oh, absolutely, right? Ten-inch, yeah, ten, ten inch, it just plays it on the loop. A little voice box there. Yeah, yeah and then exactly. you can't shut it off once you get it to start. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, and then we're going to have the King Ezekiel figure as well too. It's going to feature his staff that will actually come out and have his sword in there as well too. So the oh, staff cool. will have the... Exactly. And then following through in the 7 inch line, we're also going to have the new Rick Grimes from the All Out War story arc as well. Going to be in his all denim outfit right there with his rifle in hand as well. And he also will have a beard. It'll be one of the first Rick Grimes figures that we have with his beard in the uh, in this sculpt as well. And then we're going to have a new 10 inch Negan. Uh, it's going to be the Merciless edition, what we're calling it. It's going to feature him in his traditional outfit, but he's going to have a clean-shaven face this uh, this time around. And he's also going to have a bloody variant uh, available as well, too. And then moving on with the 7-inch line, Smoking we're also going to yeah, <laughs> play action there. Right? Exactly. <laughs> totally. And he's also going to have the 7-inch all-out war Negan figure as well, um, which will also feature a bloody variant uh, available in stores uh, very, very soon coming this fall. Any uh, chance we get an Ezekiel 5-inch? or? Um, right now, we're still trying to hammer out some other stuff with the, uh, cause we're going to run with the uh, Ally 3 pack right now for that. And then in terms of 5-inch for Ezekiel, uh, we'll see exactly what comes out in the future. Probably right now, 2018 is pretty set, but I mean, generally, uh, whatever some retailers come calling for, you know, exclusives, we can throw that in there. But generally right now, we're just kind of stuck with this right now, and uh, we're going to move forward in 2019, maybe with some additional 5-inches. So the focus is more on 7-inch at this point? Yes, uh, so for The Walking Dead, we're moving back into 7-inch, more articulation. Uh, yes. Ezekiel and Daryl are going to have a lot more articulation in the figures um, as opposed to like the previous uh, installments, uh, which we're really looking forward to. They're going to have about 18, 15, 12 to 15 points of articulation, mm -hmm. so there's a lot more you know, pulsable uh, figures coming out for them. Gotcha. Um, any other comic figures? Uh, right now, we're going to have the resin statue of Ezekiel and uh, Shiva. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that will be coming out later on this year. Um, and then maybe some exclusives around San Diego Comic-Con, uh, but uh, for right now, it's going to be the AMC in, in retail for right now. Cool. Thank you, man. <laughs> well, yeah.